Why, hello everyone! Welcome back to Psychonauts on Playframe. We are gonna move this darn story forward a bit more today, but first, but first, I did a little work over the weekend, and I got myself a... Goodness, let's stay away from that. Uh, it's nighttime out, so there's a lot of, uh, psychic animals out being very dangerous and such, but... I braved all that to go out there and do a whole lot of dousing. I got myself a lot of arrowheads. Enough to buy just about everything that I think I'm gonna be wanting pretty much for the rest of the playthrough, I think. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't hurt to have a few more, why not? We got a lot now. It should buy us the cobweb duster, it should buy us the magnet power, it should buy us the levitation ball color change thing, just about everything we need. So, let's go do that real quick. It's nice having that all out of the way, let me tell you. Hey, anything new in the store? Take a look. Let's see, first things oh, first. My last cobweb duster. Yeah. Get that into someone's mind with you. You can clean up. They're happy to be rid of the webs, and you can turn them in for psi cards. Yeah, this will make it so we can do, well, just pretty much everything else that we need to handle inside of any given mind we go into. So, better to get this sooner rather than later. Sold to the big-headed kid with a glove. Excellent. The cobweb duster is a real-world device that can project itself along with you into the mental world. Aim it at any mental cobwebs you find and press Y to collect the cobweb. Later, bring the cobweb duster to Agent Crawler's Sanctuary, where your captured cobwebs can be redeemed for psi cards in the mental cobweb detangler. What else can I do you for? You can do me for this thing. Here's something every young psi cadet needs. Cool. <laughs> Excellent choice. I keep expecting an explanation. From now on, useful psychic energy will automatically be drawn towards you from a distance. What else can I do you for? It's real nice. Uh, that, you can change the color of some of your psi powers. Like yes. Like levitation ball and what have you and what not. Well, kind of a vanity thing. You know, in my day, psi powers <laughs> were all sold to the big-headed kid with a glove. Thank you. Talk to Ford Crawler when you want to do some colorizing. Okay. What else can I do you for? Uh, now, let's see. Dream now. You take that psi core there, put it together with nine I don't psi need cards. more of those right now. I think I got a handful of them. Let's go ahead and stock up on a few of these, just for uh, the road. Okay. That's it for now. All right. Go get more airheads and come on back. Support your local. All right. We got everything we need. We are prepared to succeed. Actually, let's go talk to Ford Crawler so we can change our uh, levitation ball color. That sounds like a fun thing to do. First, let me. Uh, See if I can run past this thing, or just bop it in the face if you- Nah, you know what? Who needs it? So the, like, wild cats or jaguars or whatever the heck those things are, they, uh, try to set you on fire. And when you're on fire, you can't use any of your abilities. Uh... Where would you like me to take you, Agent? So the fighting the bears, just keep a distance from them and zap them, uh, with side Blast three times, and you're usually okay. With the, uh... Mountain lions, I guess? Uh, you, uh, need to get in close enough to them to bop them three times, but, like, you gotta find some trick for getting in close to them before you get set on fire, which... I guess invisibility would probably do it. There's probably several ways you can go about it. Anyway, uh... Let's go to Ford's... I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, noble psycho master. Forward! Okay. What are you doing here? You said that girl was waiting for you down by the water. That's Lungfish territory, boy. Go and get her! I'm going, I just got, like... a levitation ball. I know it doesn't seem super important right now. But if you think about it, it's actually very important. Agent Crawler? Sure, how goes the training? Uh... What's Titanium? What's Titanium? Titanium is a very rare psychoreactive mineral that crashed here on a meteorite hundreds of years ago. It responds to psychic waves, focuses them, amplifies them. It can make psychics more psychic. Uh, I guess we've heard all this before, haven't we? It can we? also make unstable people more unstable. Not everyone can handle that much activity in that part of their brain. It can drive them completely out of their gourd. Gives this valley an interesting history. Hmm? All right, well, you know, maybe I didn't need to see you here. Maybe what I needed to do was actually just uh, call you with the bacon. I'd better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Let's get out of here. Okay, so let me... Nope. No, don't grind on the... What are you doing, Raz? Uh, Raz, what is, what is this? What are you... Okay, let's just stand on 
Earth. That's fine. Uh, so, if I call Crawler here. There's that smell again. Uh, need to regroup, need your analysis on hostile. Can you change the color of my levitation ball? That's what I want to know. Can I change the color of my levitation ball? Like, say, to what? Ooh, okay. Uh, we got like a, a lavender, a blue, a pink, a yellow, green, orange, kind of creamy, purple, white, another pink. There's a lot of colors here, actually. Hmm. Feels like a pink is most fitting for this channel, huh? Not sure which pink exactly. It's kind of close-ish. Let's try this out. Okay. Hope that makes you feel pretty. I hope so too. Nothing more to report at this time. Crawl her out. Uh, testing. Hey, it's got the pink and the green. All right, we are in business now, y'all. We are in business. Ah, crap! We're almost on fire. Dog on it. Watch it. He's Watch it. darn mountain lions or whatever. Stop it! Thank you. Darn psychic animals. Okay, let's get down to the lake and. Hopefully be on time to save someone. Bobby! Uh-oh. Look, I can explain. <laughs> Jeez, it sounds like you caught a bad cold. Maybe. But listen, I traced the psychic interference back to Coach Oleander's radio. He's been broadcasting his insane plot all over camp in his sleep. So he's really kidnapping children and stealing their brains to make weapons. Yes! Isn't that great? What? How is that great? Because this is an honest-to-goodness psychic emergency! And Sasha's not here. He left on some official psychonauts business. Mia left a note saying the same thing! Lily, a deranged man-man is building an army of psychic death tanks to take over the world, and there's no one who can stop him, except for you and me! Oh my god! Let's make out! Uh, what? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just so excited. Since you showed up, Raz, things are so much more exciting. Sinister death plots, <laughs> mad scientists, hideous monsters. Make out? How long have I ignored what this camp had to offer? Everything's new to me now, thanks to you. I mean, look at this flower. You mean, like, kiss? How many years have I been coming here and I've never even noticed a cool flower like this before? Oh, boy. Ah, crumbs, that's where we can't go. Let's get him! I... can't. I can't swim. Well, then use the bathysphere at the end of the dock. Quick! While the flipper prints are still glowing! Are you coming? I don't know how to drive that thing. Uh, I can't. I have to, um, uh, check on the other children. Yes, yes. If the brains are out, they'll need supervision. And possibly refrigeration. And how can you not know how to operate a bathysphere? Haven't you ever been to a summer camp before? <laughs> now get a move on before that girl gets overly digested. Man, I love this game. Okay. So the bathysphere. Are you gonna help? Admiral, sir, did you hear that? The hideous hulking lungfish of Lake Oblongata just kidnapped Lily. Lungfish? So that's what's been tearing up my canoes. Well, I know just what to do. You do? Great! Yeah, I've got some lungfish proof to lack. I'll just slap on a fresh coat, maybe two, and that's that. Admiral, the monster is still out there, and Coach Oleander is trying to take over the world. Ah, well, yes, the world's a crazy place, son, but, but don't worry. The canoes are safe. <laughs> uh, okay. I guess it's up to us. And our gorgeous psychic powers. I shouldn't do that on this uh, narrow little path. Ooh. Free cards. 
All right, into the bathosphere. Let me in. It's a deep lake. And here we'll remain, I guess, for some time. Hmm. Ooh. Well, if I actually still needed money, this would probably be a great place to get it. The creature's prints are still glowing. This must be where he brought Lily. Well, let's track it. Yep. Huh. Is this anything? Hello? Lily? Eh. Come on. Uh. Oh, here we go. Here it comes. Okay, cough up the girl and no one gets hurt, fish. Man, it's gonna be hard to find a new place to give you lumps. Ah, geez. Okay, uh, hang on. I got levitation powers here. Let's give you some nails ah uh, you stopped that's ah now you're spitting again don't don't do ow fish bad fish let go fish fish no bad fish oh i should just hit these boxes while it's inhaling cool bam there we go nails more nails yes it's more nails more nails there we go Ah, jeez. Whoa. <laughs> oh, we gotta stay inside the water. Bad crabs. Lobsters. Whatever you are. I don't know. Oh, that's neat. You can see, like, the little water hands kind of... ...reaching out for me near the edge. Spooky. Uh, careful. Ugh. Come on. Erg. Easy does it. Just gotta stay out of the water. Eh. Wonder what these these like coral? Freshwater coral? <laughs> Just these little things I'm breaking. These walls. Is it fight time? No? No, no. We're still, uh... <laughs> we're still auto scrollering then. Very well. I mean, it's not the most exciting gameplay-wise, necessarily, but... Concept-wise, pretty good. I do just love having all the, uh, sea life falling into this bubble. I think it's pretty clever. Ow! No, stay out of the water. Uh... 
Ah. Huh. Why are you eating those? All right, we can do this. Just gotta break the nails. When it inhales. There we go. Bam! I says, bam! Come on, bam! There we go. All right, one more. There we go. Yes. We're doing so good at this very Zelda-esque boss. Uh, where do I go here? Oh, here we go. We. It's definitely a little trickier platforming to a camera angle you don't control in any way. Ah, okay. Oh, I do love our little pink ball. Do, 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 do. So, Fish, are we done with this trip yet? Or, um, no? Okay. Yep. Because, like, I'm ready to fight again. If you are. I do appreciate this tour you're giving me of your whole... little pond home. Sorry for breaking all the walls. Ooh, this could be fun. Ah, jeez. Oh, no. Slide! Nice. Okay, but for real, can we fight again? Okay, good! Yay! Hooray. Uh, okay, so no shoot. Um, oh, okay, right, let's get it to swing its little, uh, thing there into one of these. There, that's it. And then, bam, bam, bam! Nice, okay. We got the pattern. We got the pattern. Try it again. Yeah, and then bop, bop, bop! Yes. Yeah, look out. Come on, one more time. Do it again. Yes. Bop, bop, bop! You all right? Ah, oh, poor little thing. That poor little thing just tried to kill me about eight different ways. Well, that's not its fault. This was once just a normal-sized lungfish, minding its own business in a mucus-lined air bubble beneath a semi-dry lake bed. But judging by the work done on it, I suspect Maury has mutated it, accelerated its growth, and has placed an implant in its brain to make it do his evil bidding. Whoa. Poor little thing. Yeah, go inside there and try to smash the implant. Use the psycho portal I saw you steal from Sasha's lab. Oh, uh, yeah. That works on big scary monsters? Oh, monster schmonster. That thing's more afraid of you than you are of it. <laughs> now get in there. All right. But, uh... Whoa. Poor little thing. All right. I guess... We're gonna go in a fish brain. Let's do it. This is a good level, by the way. the morning to you, ma'am. And good day to you, Officer of Lungfish. How are you today? Oh, damp and happy, can't complain. And what are you and the wee one up to on this lovely day? Oh, just obeying the law as always. All posted directives followed to the letter. Ah, good to hear. Not a one of us want any trouble, that's for sure. Ah! Oh, Gagalo!
Oh, we're a big monster. Go to Kochamara Tower and destroy it. <laughs> oh, look at us walking around like a big monster. Meh. <laughs> Our jump and everything feels different. This is very good. Eh. And I think, if I recall... I don't think that's gonna work. Yep, we're too big and heavy to do levitation. That's fine. Hey, Gogolor! Down here! Excuse me. Were you talking to me? Ah, ow! My ears! I'm sorry. Ah, oh my god! Ah! Are you okay? He's dead. Oh geez, I'm sorry. Don't worry. Every member of the Resistance is prepared to die fighting the tyranny of Kochamara. What's Kochamara? He's a giant monster like you, Gargalore. He brainwashed and enslaved almost everyone in Lungfishopolis. That stinks. So hey, have you seen any other humans around here? I'm looking for a girl called Lily. The government archives might have some information about your young girlfriend, Gogolor. Yeah, I don't know if she's really my girlfriend. I mean, I think she... I only meant that she's <laughs> your friend who was a girl, Gogolor. To access the archives, we must first destroy the broadcast tower Kochamara uses to control the populace. Check. I'll go smash that then. Wait, Gogolor! In order to reach the tower, you'll need to pass through that wall of lasers. But you'll never make it through the lasers without our help. So are you gonna start helping soon? First, I need you to do something for the Resistance. Punch a hole in that prison and free my comrades! Can do. Pardon me. Excuse me. You might want to get out of the way there. Oh, sorry. Okay, well. Freedom! 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 <laughs> How about getting me past those gates? Right. We stole the shield power module from Coach Amara. It's too big for any of us to operate, but it should work for you. Uh, this is a good video game. Upset Kochamra and all your little brainwashed neighbors? No, I doubt it. Uh, no, no. <laughs> so, knocking down the prison and then breaking this laser shield thing, nobody's gonna get mad about that and start shooting at me. No, uh, maybe one guy would. But what is even an entire navy of lungfish against the might and revolutionary zeal of Gogalore? Wait, what navy? Meet us at the dam, Gogalore. For freedom! <laughs> okay, use your psychic shield to protect you from damage and reflect some enemy attacks back at the attacker. Note, you will not be able to maintain a psychic shield forever, and when this part of your mind's exhausted, you'll need to wait a while before you use it again. Alright, well, let's, um, let's, uh, equip the thing. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Actually, let's do it over the, uh, hang on, levitation back here and get rid of the, uh, or, yeah, you know what I mean. Okay! We freed some dissidents. Now let's explore the town and rendezvous with the dissidents at the dam. It's Run! Oh, hey, baggage. Whoop. The peaceful city of Lungfishopolis is under attack tonight by a hideous, gigantic monster the terrified citizens have named Gogalor. The Navy has responded quickly and decisively, dispatching its entire tank division <laughs> to neutralize the creature. Soon, authorities say, everything will return to normal or better. Kidnapping human children is good. <laughs> the Navy has Please dispatched me, their tanks. Okay. This guy needs a duffel bag tank. All right, well, I'll go find it then. Get on my way. This guy needs a duffel I'm bag tank. doing it. Ooh, water. Ah, is this fine? <laughs> ah, the Navy's tanks. Bah, bad tanks. Stop shooting at me. Tanks, we talked about this. Cut it out. 
Sorry, buildings. It was the tanks, you see. Ah! Get out of here! I don't really have a lot of precision attacks. Ooh, this level's fun. Alright, so we got... lasers to get through. With our fancy shield, which is... There we go. Uh... All right, we good? Yes? Excellent! Oh, jeez, that's a lot of tanks. Yeah. Stop it, tanks! Thank you. Hey, here's that double bag tag. Stop it. Bam! There we go. Oh, that didn't work. Bam, I says. Let me get some of these figments and stuff. Don't think I have this yet. I need the purse tag here. That makes sense. I thought I saw. Could have sworn I said, "Yeah, I did see." Just a little bitty secret safe over here. Hey, bam! Lungfish Opolis under siege. Happy life. Hmm. Interesting. They worship the new being. Start building. <laughs> Create a big metropolis, and now there is a rebel faction. Love it. Now let's try to free some more dissidents. There you are. Freedom! 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 <laughs> Freedom! So, this big monster, is that the best you could do? We were short on time, and he is good at smashing things. Doesn't look like much to me. Come on, let's blow this joint. Hey, you're welcome. Sorry about him, Gargalor. He's been in prison a long time. He's the only pilot the Resistance has, and he has an excellent plan. Meet us at the dam so we can put it into action. You got it. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm so slow as a big monster. Ooh, I can collect this now. That's fun. Hang on. Hang on, here we go. And... Yes! And, yep, that's pretty much it. <laughs> Now I have cobwebs. No tanks. Leave me be. Nope. Let me collect my figments and move on with life. Ah! Sorry. Stop zapping me. Tanks, I swear. Well, things have gotten a little embarrassing for Gagalore. Recently surfaced information has strongly linked the previously intimidating monster with common low-life criminals. Earlier tonight, Gagalore broke some of his jailhouse cronies out of the slammer so they could enjoy a night on the town, popping pills and soliciting inexpensive car girls. Well, they're in for one nasty hangover. Our beloved Navy has come up with a high-tech new invention. Trucks armed with hyper-electricity. Kidnappy children do not harm the brains. You know, I don't think Coach understands the branches of the military very well. Nah. Let's see, can I just shoot them at range or um, watch it quit? Quit, I says. Fire! Nope, that's not working. Well, let me collect this here and then, uh, thank you. And then we'll sneak around. Sneakily. Bam! Nope, not good enough. Ow. Bam, I says. Bam, I says. Good enough. Eh. Hide. Oh, come on. Bam, I says. Give me that health. Thank you. Nah. Tanks, please. Ooh, give me this. I love the sort of weird hang time you get here. That still weirdly makes you feel heavy. 
Boy, so much news. The destruction and terror continue as the hulking, godless child beast carves a bloody swath through our helpless city. Our noble, all-volunteer navy has been surprised only by the senseless lust for mayhem that seeps from the twisted black lump of a heart in this creature, still known only as Gogolo. Though it loathes violence in all its forms, the navy has no choice but to activate its anti-monster turrets, which it guarantees are 100% monster-proof. Not get caught stealing children. <laughs> This is just all so creative, right? No. Ah, geez, that does hurt a lot, though. Dream Fluff activated, thank goodness. Boy, that does a lot of damage fast. I guess I should use my shield, huh? That's not the button. There we go. There we go. Ah, there we are. Yeah, the shield's what I should have been using. see the genius of our plan, Gogalore. First, we print fly. Then we spread them all over town with my blimp. Winning over the hearts and minds of Longfishopolis in as soon as six months. Six months? You don't like our plan, you can come up with another one. Yes, we are busy. We have to select cardstock and then find a decent but inexpensive printer within the week. <laughs> it's all so good. All right. Tanks? I swear. Stop. Uh, let's see. Can I hop on the blimp? That seems like a good plan, right? Here we go. Knock it off. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I need that figment though. Hey. Thank you. All right. Taking action into our own hands, our own enormous hands. Let me down. There we go. Oh, it's such a long walk, but I want this item real bad. Also luggage, but I don't know if I have a tag for it. Yep. Eh, come on. This hat box needs a hat Dog box on it. Tag. I need tags. And I need this. Yep. Give. Thank you. Also, I wish I could do this without having to dig into my, um, whoops. Without having to dig into my inventory, but so be it. Got it. Thank you. I think I accidentally switched my powers around. Whoopsie. There we go. Alright, back to it. Ah, oh, man, the tag was right over here. Oh, it's such a long, slow walk. Come on. And now we gotta go back. So slow. There we go. Ooh, forward flips. Those are slightly faster. Thank goodness. <laughs> uh. So catchy. All right, so. Yeah, this is a little faster. All right. I'm speed running. Okay, I'm done speed running. Can I climb buildings? Nope. Turns out, no. Can I climb? Yeah, there we go. That's what I like to see. Sorry. I want those figments. I am a figgy piggy, as I was once called. Ooh, a side power upgrade earned. Palm Mega Bomb. After you start a Palm Bomb, press X as many times as you can before you hit the ground. The more times you press X, the higher the bonus damage. That's nifty. Cool. I like that a lot. Come on. Make it. Ah, good enough. Navy, stop it. I hate that. Navy. At least this is actually boats. Good job, Navy. Wow, oh, geez. That water will actually get me, it seems. Whoa, I can pick up tanks? You kidding? Come here. Oh, I can pick and throw them? Yeah. Oh, this just got so much better. Hey. Pick up tank. Oh, I did not pick up tank. Okay. 
Let's start being a little more tactical here. Instead of getting murdered constantly and all the time. Sneak. Sneak and then smack! Ha <laughs> ha! You puny fishlings are no match for my sneaky, stealthy, giant fist attacks. Let's get out of here. Uh, can I go up here? That'd be great. Yeah, all right. What's over there? Ow, you know what, never mind. Moving on. Yeah. Ah, jeez. <laughs> Oh, I just accidentally hit a thing. <laughs> lungfish and Lobato. Hmm. So there's a lungfish that was hanging out down here, watching TV. Got caught. Ah, oh, got experimented on by Dr. Lobato. And turned into this. I see. And then sent back into the water. With the objective of finding children and bringing their brains back. I see. So there always was a lake monster. And we're in its brain now. Fighting the populace. Nothing can stop him. Ooh, give me your cobwebs. Yeah, this is a little cumbersome here. Love to have a button dedicated to this. That's okay. No biggie. Stop shooting me. All the time. I hate it. Blocking it. Oh, neat. Okay, I should have been doing it. I need to just be using the shield all the time, I guess. Come on. And you zapped. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Good thing I bought the dream fluffs. Let me through. Eh. Come on. Let me up. There we go. And we're across. We're here with the star of the popular sitcom Trouble in the Bubble, Buddy Finn. Buddy, what's your take on the God of War situation? <laughs> Is he just misunderstood? No way! I hate God of War. <laughs> I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He hates everything lungfish care about. Air, water, family, the economy. <laughs> Buddy, you'll be happy to know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. Airplanes! <laughs> so rest assured, we can all look forward to Gardalore's imminent death. And to seeing you, buddy, every Thursday night at 8, right here on LBC. Thanks, and I'd just like to add that if anyone kidnaps a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. Mm. Gardalore, come in. We have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Kochamara Channel to get to Kochamara Island and destroy Kochamara Tower. The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will soon contain the area, Gogolor, we, uh... uh... We just think it best to wear... Uh, We've decided to maintain our position out here. <laughs> Just until you clear the area of all hostiles. Yes. For insurance reasons, Gargalor. Yes, that, and for freedom. Fine, I'll do everything then. I am the large monster, I guess. Sorry, trains. Climb. Give me figments. I need them. Ooh, a Psy Blast upgrade in a few more ranks. That's exciting. Come on, Raz, can't you climb a little faster for me, buddy? Maybe a little? Ooh. Yes. Nice. All right, planes. Knock it off. That's enough. Hey! Oh, my goodness. It took so long to climb up there, planes. You're terrible. Uh, five more planes. Let's see. How high up do I have to get to lock onto planes? Planes? 
There's one. Mm, I don't, can I get another one? Maybe. Come on. Give me something. Bam! And bam! And bam! One more. Yes, there we go. Freedom! Freedom indeed. Yes. We're almost there. Ah! Hang on there. There we go. Alright. It's time to go destroy the radio tower. But you know what? Let's do- Oh wow, there's luggage up here. How'd you get up here? We're gonna destroy that radio tower next time. Thank you all so very much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow for that radio tower destroying anything I talked about. Y'all have yourselves a good one. Goodbye!